Tag Romney is the son of Mitt Romney, of course. He apparently did not like the way the last debate went. Now, his dad was in Barack Obama's face all night long. He kept walking up to him and challenging him. And by the way, I think there's nothing wrong with that. I think both sides should do that, right? But Romney was a more aggressive one throughout. He kept going up to him and saying, okay, what's in your pension plan? What's in your pension plan? What's in your pension plan, right? Now, did you lower the leases on public land? Did you lower it? Did you lower it? Et cetera. But apparently, Obama had the temerity to actually answer some of those questions, to also be aggressive. Not as aggressive as Romney, but also to be, how dare you? Well, that gave Tag Romney a visceral reaction. Uh, let's hear it. What is it like for you <laughs> to hear the President of the United States call your dad a liar? Uh, how do you, you know, react to that? Uh, well, it, jump out of your seat and you want to rush down the debate stage and take a <laughs> swing at him. But you know you can't do that because... Uh, uh, well, first, because there's a lot of secret service between you and him, but also because this, this is the nature of the process. Now, look, here's the thing. A lot of people are outraged by this. Uh, I, I was This morning, I was not that outraged by it. And I, and I thought, look, it's his son. Uh, he doesn't mean he physically wants to take a swing at him. He just means, like, God, that makes me angry. Now, the, here's who you should be angry at, your dad, because he's a goddamn liar, okay? And that's why Obama was saying he was a liar, because you know he's a liar. You know that tax plan's full of crap. You know that if you cut 20% for the, everybody, and most especially the rich, there's no way in the world you can balance the budget. You know all that. You know your dad's lying about the binder full of women. You know your dad's lying about all this stuff. So save your anger for the right person, which is your dad, not Obama. But anyway, of course, it's his dad. I get it. And he, so he gets angry, and, and he, he says this. But he's, I think he was mainly saying it tongue-in-cheek. But, you know, JR, I think, made a really good point this morning. I wanted to share it with you guys. JR, uh, what... What would have happened if, if the roles were a little reversed? What yeah, as, as we, you know, every time we said, imagine the outrage that would come from Republicans if this was the other way around. So, I mean, Obama has two daughters, fine. But they got Michelle Obama clapping and what they call a cretin yesterday over it? Uh, uh, miscreant. Miscreant. <laughs> a miscreant over clapping and breaking the decorum of the debate. But you're talking about you. The only reason I didn't rush the stage and take a swing at the president of the United States is because of the Secret Service. Now, yeah, you can say it tongue in cheek, but saying any, you also can't say tongue in cheek. Uh, you know, it's a fire in this theater. You know, you just can't say certain things because that's dangerous for your own life, probably. So just imagine you have a grown son of the president. Well, forget it. I won't even play the whole imagine this black guy saying, I'm going to come beat the hell out of Mitt Romney. A Democrat, Joe Biden's son. I want to rush the stage and kick Paul Ryan's ass. Oh, my God. God, the apple doesn't fall far from the tree, you know? Look at these aggressive assholes, Democrats. They would lose their minds over this. You, just can't, you can think whatever you want. You can defend your father in your brain and say it amongst your friends and family. But you can't tell people that you want to go take a swing at the president. It's outrageous. You see, J.R. makes a good point, and that's the, the core of this story. Not what I personally think of Tag Romney. Do, do I think he would have taken a swing? Do I think Bo Biden, if he had said something similar, you should take that altogether too seriously? No, right? But it's an uneven playing field. JR is right. If Biden's son had said he wanted to rush the stage and take a swing at Paul Ryan, all over television right now, and the Republicans would be like, look at the Democrats. Look at how they are. They're so vicious and vile and disgusting and violent. And this is how they solve things, et cetera. And then, come on, keep it real. If, if it was President Obama's grown son, a, a black kid says, or, or, or a black adult said, I'm a, I wanted to rush the stage and punch the president in the face, how would they have characterized that? Oh, you know the answer. You, you can be conservative, liberal, moderate, it doesn't matter. You know what the answer is.